Well, hey guys, welcome back to Southern Adventures. Um, I stopped off here off 64 Highway at the Ranger Station, and we're gonna head up to Howie Mountain. I just came back from one of my other trips going out to G Creek. Thought it'd be fun to make a quick little video of going up to the uh, scenic overlooks up here on uh, Chilhowie. Uh, overlooks Parksville Lake in certain areas, and also takes you up to the Chilhowie Recre Recreational Facility. And from there, you can actually take the trail out to Benton Falls. And I've actually got a couple videos of trails going out to Benton Falls, and I'll link them in the description down below, and uh, I'll try to put one of those little tag things up here. I forget which side it goes on. So I hope you guys enjoy the trip. I'll stop at each one of the little scenic uh, lookout lookovers, and uh, we'll stop there, take some pictures, and uh, let you guys look around a little bit, so decide if you want to come up to this area. Chilhowie Recreational Center is a really nice place. There is a fee to park. I think it's three dollars, but um, you know it's got nice little picnic areas, places to tent camp, um, RV camp, and if it's vacant. Um, and there's also a lake at the very top of the mountain here too that you can go swim in. It's got a little beach area as well. So if you got some extra time, a couple days, you want to come up and spend a nice time with the kids, or just uh, you and your significant other. It's a great place to come, relax, swim, camp, do some cooking out. Really is a pretty area. Plus you get the scenic overlooks too, which are really nice. All right, we got our first lake overview here. We're gonna stop here, take a look around and take a few pictures. Wow, that's pretty. Hey guys, we are at that first little overview on the left here, and we're going to take a look around here first, and we'll head up to the second one on the left up here. Pretty much think they offer about the same view, just a little bit different perspective though. We're definitely going to stop here and take some pictures, um, and then I'll jump back in the truck and uh, we'll head up the other way. But first I'll show the, the overlook on the camera here. I don't know if you can see behind me there, but this uh, this little overlook has a trail that goes to the uh, left side there. Uh, and you, It goes back a couple miles. It doesn't really go to anything, but it just kind of goes across to some different areas where you can overlook as well if you'd like to get out here and hike a little bit. But I'm gonna take a few pictures of this area right here and uh, we'll get back on the road. So here is the second one. It's, it's pretty much, um, yeah, they call this one the Sugarloaf Overlook. It's pretty much just right up, high quarter of a mile away from the first one and I think it pretty much overlooks the same thing but we'll stop here and take some pictures as well all right we're at that second overlook now on the left side and it's pretty much the same overlook as we saw on the very first one it just gives you a little bit different perspective so we'll look around up here just a little bit and we'll get back on the road and um, and hit that next overview little picnic area, grill area out here too. It really is a beautiful area. Birds flying around. All right, we'll get back in the truck and head on up the road. Left, this next one is the one I was talking about. It's on the right side and uh, it overlooks Parksville Lake, which is absolutely beautiful. We'll pull in here for a minute and we'll get out and take some pictures. It's a little bit hazy today, so the pictures may not turn out all that great. We're gonna get out and take some pictures anyway. Very pretty area. That is parcel lake down there we're looking at. All right, so we're leaving that Parksville Lake overlook and now we're gonna head up to the one with the gazebo and it'll be on the left. And that will be one of the, the last ones you could stop at and take pictures until 
you get up to the uh, Cheer Alley Recreational Center, and there's no really overlook there. It's more of just a rec center with camping and all that kind of stuff. Guys, tell me if you enjoy these little ride-through videos like this. It doesn't involve a lot of outdoors or a lot of out, you know, hiking, that type of thing, waterfalls, the stuff I normally do. But I wanted to make a few of these videos of areas that I like to come to, bring the kids to, things like that, uh, that don't require a lot of effort to get out to. So, you know, if there's certain places that you guys want to see, uh, please leave that in the comments down in the bottom and uh, let me know what you'd like to see. So we're coming out on that, uh, that, that very last lookout, and this is going to be the one that's got the gazebo. Uh, this is everybody's favorite. It offers a fantastic view. Uh, you can probably see the casino there as I'm turning in gazebo um, but we're going to get out here and spend a little time and take some pictures then we're going to head up to the uh the rec center and check it out short you know just just a short video of that area as well all right here we are at the gazebo overlook and we're going to walk up here look around for a second and take some pictures Pretty neat little area. I'm gonna walk into the gazebo real quick. It's gonna get a little dark with the camera here because it's just on auto. It'll brighten back up. Beautiful area. That overlook. All right, guys. starting to get a little windy out here. All right, I'll stop it here. All right, here we are at the Shell Howie Recreational Area. All right, guys, so we are out here at the Chill Howie Recreation Center, and we're just going to stop here for just a few minutes and take a quick look around. I'll show you where the Benton Trailhead is and uh, a little bit around the area. All right, guys, here are some of the facilities I'm talking about. They have got some really nice areas up here, benches and um, grills for you as well. Uh, on up here to the left, you have got a little bathroom facility as well. And I think all the camping areas are back down that direction to my left. We'll walk down just a little bit further here. I'll show you where the trailhead is to Benton Falls and while we're doing that we'll walk down to the lake real quick because it is actually where the trailhead begins. All right guys there is a little more of those camp or those um, little eating areas and then here is the lake and you've got you a little beach area there where you can bring the kids up. I see some folks got their dogs up here. And we're gonna walk back in the other direction just so I can show you the, uh, the trailhead. And if you come back by the bathroom facilities here, the actual trailhead is around back behind the bathroom facility. And there's another little parking area to where it brings you right up to where the trailhead is. So again, it's pretty much just right behind the bathroom facility. You walk on down a little ways here, and there you go. There's your trailhead to Benton Falls. And it goes right by the lake there. So hey guys, if you wanna check out that video of uh, Benton Falls, I've got a couple on the channel. I'll, uh, I'll link them in the description below, and uh, I'll tag them at the end of uh, this video here. Well, I am gonna head back to the truck, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this short video. Um, coming up Chilhowee Mountain, checking out some of the overlooks, and uh, coming up to the very top here at the Chilhowee Rec Center. 
But listen, guys, that's going to end it for this video. But until next time, get out there and create your own adventure.